Hi, Jonathan Pickup. Welcome to my podcast, 090, my 90th podcast. Let's have a look at dimensions and viewports in Vectorworks 2010. Here's a drawing I created earlier. Let's enter our viewport. So right mouse click, edit annotations. And I'm going to put a dimension in here. From there, down to there. Now when you place a dimension, make sure that you get those green squares on them. I've covered associative dimensions before, so you can go back and look at some of my old you know, YouTube movies or my old podcasts, but just notice that I clicked very carefully on the corners of my walls. I've now got an associative dimension. Let's go back to my framing plan. So one of the ways of getting to it, of course, double click on this, let's choose go to our design layer. And there's my wall. Let's just pull that wall down. Let's go back to our viewport. Notice that my dimensions are updated. So if you put dimensions inside a viewport and you place them carefully, they will associate to the objects. And when you move them in the design layer, the dimensions in your viewport will update. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to visit www.arconcad.co.nz